in this video, we fly a plane that's available on the new Battle Pass. It's Swedish, it's basically a P-51, and it's simply called... David. I don't know what's so funny to me that a plane is just simply called David, but here we are. This is a J-26 that's available on the new Battle Pass today. Uh, you can get a test fly for this thing if you buy the Battle Pass, and then you can earn it later on once you've... Ugh. Once you've got so many rewards, or spent a lot of money. Anyway, welcome back to the channel, I'm back from Silverstone and my adventures. I'll probably put some footage up of that tomorrow, but... <laughs> so... Yeah! Today we're just gonna fly this thing out in ground RB. I don't think the P-51 is a great ground RB aircraft. It's not very good at low altitude. We only get two bombs, which both drop in sequence, which means you only get one bomb drop. And then this version only has 450 cals which one of which runs out of ammo after half the belt, so it's a bit of a strange one. We've had a couple of belt options, but honestly the default one is exactly the same as the ground target one, which is kind of strange. Uh, they have the exact same ammunition, just in a different order. 30 millimeters of penetration, which is good enough for most tanks top down. Uh, open tops, of course, are at your complete mercy, but not a lot of ammunition. 1200 rounds is not a lot compared to some other vehicles that you can take out at this BR and lower as well. And considering Sweden's got some nice aircrafts with the 13 millimeter machine, guns such as the G22A, uh, it's kind of like, why would you bring this? I'm sure it's very good in air RB, but you know, I only play ground RB, so we're going to take it out anyway. We're going to be bringing it out with the SAV 2012-48, this thing is an absolute menace. I won't go too ham in this thing, we'll get enough kills to get us in the plane, because of course this video is about the plane. I've got plenty of videos on this thing though, an absolute savage. I don't think it's available to buy anymore, so it's pretty fun to take it out whenever we get the opportunity. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into battle and see how David gets on. Right, we got Winter Poland. Come on, let's go, Sav. We're just gonna go straight up to the ACAP. It's a bit of an up tier, I think. Oh, uh, actually, yeah, it's a little bit. It's 4-0. This thing is pure evil. We, we just really need to get in our plane early because you can get really carried away, really carried away in this thing. Not quite woken up yet, so we'll see how we get on. Had a wonderful time at Silverstone, so... Coming back to play War Thunder. This is going to be an interesting one. I'm in full, like, race car mode. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I can't pin him, apparently. Oh, no, we got him, we got him. I don't know where this other guy really is. Okay, we're good. We just overpressured the living crap out of both of these dudes. Does this replace as fast as it used to? I don't really want the cap, I just want to kill the dudes. I'm surprised I haven't been artilleried by this lad yet. Oh, he's moving off. That's good for me. If he was just to sit there, it would have been a problem. Goodbye. <laughs> right, we'll definitely have our airplane. With bombs. Without a doubt. So, oh, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Run! Go away, Stug! Okay, it was a Stu, not a Stug. He's got quite a reload on that 105, so... We should be able to get into the clear. I'm gonna I hook a left here. So, we can go through the driver hatch of the Stu, but we can shoot above the driver hatch a bit. Good my... Um, one there, he's, it's the Stu, he's coming. That did nothing. <gasps> Come on, autoloader. Oh, this guy's making a little bit of a mistake. Okay, we can fend there. I'm gonna move. Now he's tracked, he can't really do anything to me, so... I don't want to keep spamming my rounds at him. Oh! He real. Oh, there's a different guy, he's right next to me. Right, never mind. Let's go. I find it really funny that... <laughs> just giving a vehicle, like, a first name, like a person... You know? Like, it, like I think it's really cute. And more vehicles should have that. There's that Panzer IV I saw at the start crossing. Oh, an M10. From from all the way out. Right, does this thing... I think it's going to drop both at the same time. So a cluster would be good. But I hear a plane. I don't know where he is, though. Can I hang on to these bombs? I think I can with a fucker wolf. So we can outturn this guy all day long. 
but not with the bombs attached. I might throw them off, depending on what this guy wants to do. We're just going to do the loopings until I get behind them, because it's exactly what's going to happen. Oh, I might be able to scissor in here a little bit. If they cut the throttle just a tiny bit. Back on it again. As long as another airplane doesn't come, we're going to be all right. Another plane is coming. I hear him. Yeah, we're going to have to drop him. Definitely. It's not a fighter, so we've got a little bit of a chance. And we've got this Focke Wolf on this turn. I'm going to try and keep up with the Focke Wolf. The other guy is turning back in, is he? I'm annoyed we have to drop our bombs, but it's just how it is. Life isn't fair sometimes. Right, this guy's gonna come in for a head on, it looks like. He's got 20 mils, this dude, so we gotta be pretty careful. I'm gonna send some rounds his way, and we're just gonna pull off him. I reckon he's gonna want to get to the battlefield as quick as he can now with his bombs. So, we'll do this maneuver. Come up behind him, he's gonna try and shoot us with his rear gunner, which is cool. I think uh, I almost got his gunner. I'm going to pull away here since he is on fire after all. He might put it out. I'd like to go back and get some bombs at some stage. He's going to bomb this heavy tank, is he? Yeah. Did he miss though? Yeah, that's too far away. We got him too. All right, that was an interesting little bit. Look at the guy Tokyo drifting on the, the ice. You see him? <laughs> There's two pumas here. I think someone's trying to ship me with 20 mils. There's another Puma there. Oh, Stuka. Coming for me. That might be a Stuka D. In which case, I'm a little bit scared. Where's the other Puma? Here he is. I'll try and get this. The KV-1E is going to murder him because he can't really do anything to a KV-1E. Okay, got a nice little crit on him. And now we're going up for the Stuka. In fact, I'm flying right in front of the Stuka, apparently. I didn't expect him to engage me because, you know, he's a Stuka, but it is what it is. Right, now he's dead. Unless another plane comes again. He's going to be going very slow for us when we go back up. <gasps> Come here, dude. David's coming for you. <laughs> David. <laughs> he's rolling over this way. I think an awesome one's now shooting at me. Yeah, I think so. Look at this Stuka, dude. He's, he's actually gaming. Roger that. I don't want to waste any rounds on that guy. Because I've only got 400 bullets left. That's not ideal. This Stuka knows what he's doing, though. He's not stupid. And now he's going to fly me over that Oswin that was rattling rounds at me. Brother, this guy is... The king of Stukas. The the Stuka boss battle. Right. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of a scissor. I think he's crashing though, yeah. Okay. I think I got his engine. Right, uh I don't know if we go back and get bombs because it doesn't look like there's much time left in the game. I'm gonna see if we can spot something open top. Easy to damage, but oh we got another, another Stuka. I'm gonna turn into him, see if he'll take the bait. Okay, he's trying to escape. I got plenty of ammo left. Okay, we got an angry man. So we're gonna go for speed just so I can try and avoid this SPA as much as I can. Yeah, we're alright. Have you got bomblets? No. I want his. Okay, I got his gunner. Alright. A little bit of engine damage or oil leak or something on him. I love playing anti cast, dude. It's one of my favourite things to do. Oh god, these trees. Minecraft. Yeah, we're not gonna get him. Before we start getting shot at by his airfield. I'm gonna let him go because I don't want to die immediately from AOE damage. In a way, I hope you make it, but at the same time, it'd be nice if he crashed for uh, the old content. Nah, he's made it. 
And some fans are. Oh, there's a Puma on A cap. There's, the best way to kill a Puma is from the side and at this angle here. So. I've only got two live machine guns right now. I got two crew out of them. The other two have run out of ammunition. Right, let's go land. We're going to need to. Good thing about a 51 is we can really land at any speed we want with no gear. There we go. Very, very short track landing on a P-51. It likes to go nose down and your pilot sits up quite high so he can actually be killed by hitting the ground. So it's pretty handy. There you go, some useful information. It looks like Wooly Y has uh, disconnected and he's flying off into the distance. Okay, we got one plane over the battlefield and another one up high, which means that there's three. The sticker will be repairing. This guy's going straight up for the MiG-3. That's not a very good plane, so our mig is probably going to die unless he wins the head on. He's going to die. Yeah, he's already taken hits. And that looks like a 109. I need to be careful of this Wirble, but I also need to kill this guy. On the B-cap. He's smoked up. Clever girl. This 109 is going to be a dogfight, dude. This is going to be a good one. I'll probably lose. He's coming for the head on, is he? No, he's not. He kinda was. I got a crit on him. I really don't want to give up my bombs again. But we might have to, and that's an issue. He's flying to his verbal. He's got gun pods, so we've got a little bit more of a fighting chance than we usually would. Down he goes. I do not see the guy on B. He's because he's underneath me. Ow, the Wurble hit me. That's bad. Or was it even the Wurble that hit me? Oh, that's a truck down there, but I don't know what kind. They're taking A. Oh, it's a little, uh... The deadly slug. Oh my god, did we just get absolutely shredded? I think that's lost us the game there. <laughs> What's this spin supposed to be? <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. Probably lost this. Gonna gonna be honest. Okay, cargo board. This is not great. Good job we got massive overpressure right on a 90 millimeter. Have to focus my attention to this right hand side. Hopefully my team is gonna deal with the other end. Hmm. I'm uh. Relying a lot on my teammates, and why was there an M8 at this BR? Not that that would have helped them any in any BR, really, what he just did. I think we're about to get surrounded. In fact, there may actually be an enemy on this cap. That was bad. That's concrete. <gasps> That's concrete, Buzz. We can't shoot through that. I'm just gonna have to push out this direction. Hope for the best. Okay, that first shot could have been better, but it is what it is. We're gonna have to get off of here. Okay, I survived that direct hit from a Sherman. Massive question mark on that. But it happened. Probably the ace crew have managed to get on this thing, right? Oh, we're chasing another KV-1 round here. Or is that a T-34? I think he's facing me though. Yes, he is. Ah, oh, I missed him. I missed him, dude. That sh oh, it's an STZ. That's why it was. An, uh, it's got the extra armor. I was wondering why I didn't pen. I got him quite a flat shot. What is that big plane down there? Cola Cat is in his dicker mags having a hard time. Ah, he's down. It's a yag. Things got really good reload. He's just got into cover. I can't really see anything other than this KV. Which I don't think these bombs will kill, but we're going to try. Actually hit him with him. Yep. Yeah, hitting him there. Oh, that plane's gone. Let's go for the Yag now. If he isn't already dead. I see another open top. Looks like a Breda. Okay, I see the Yag as well. The Yag has to go. He killed our Dicker Max.
Right, that's one gone. Now my AMX-13 is coming round behind this Breda. Sort of a... Oh. Is this truck? Let's get a crit on this Breda at least so my teammate knows where he is. Never mind. We can also just kill him straight up. I'm here on a plane. It's friendly. Let's get this, this truck out of here. I think he's still focusing on me. Okay, B18's doing God's work. The, the truck hasn't noticed me, I don't think. Let's get spraying for these gunners first. Good. That chappy should have been firing at me, he wasn't. An M10. Why are you hiding there? This has been an outstanding run so far. Good lad. Good lad. Oh, he came out the other side though. Unfortunate. Right, I think that was two out of his turret crew. Which took away his 50 cal. And now the chaffee's firing at us. Where did the M10 go? Ah, I see him. That enemy plane will be coming back shortly. Goodness me, that lag. Nice. That's what you like to see. Okay, Sherman's upset. Where's this enemy aircraft? A wing just disappeared. Uh, did you see that? Aha. That was not the guy that I wanted to go for. Where is the guy on the airfield? We are definitely losing this fight, by the way. We're not in a good way, our team. It's been pretty much every game so far. He's spawn protected. We're going to have to stay quite low so we don't get shot, but also not hit one of these various lampposts. What's that? Uh, Italian fighter. It's one engine boy. He's dead. And there's the guy there. That's who I was looking for initially. But I got to avoid the M19. Right, we got A. So, something can be done. Right, what is this thing? Italian 410. I think. Just gotta keep going backwards and forwards into cover. Did that guy drop his bomb? No. He might try and drop it on me. Gunner? Please, gunner? Okay, we did get the gunner. Right, 90 bullets left. That's not a lot. And we're about to get a dogfight. My SPG is struggling to get on the B cap. Two planes, actually. I got a hits on this P47. Is that a Razorback? I have 84 rounds to take out a P47. That's not a lot. He'll outrun me all day long too. Unless he does that. Okay, we got him crit. Not sure what we crit yet, but... 63 bullets left. Where's this other enemy aircraft at? He's somewhere. Get him my fort. Get him, dude. Spray him down. He got hit by a 20 mil. He just dropped his bomb. Okay. That 104 is probably going to get him. But as long as he's dead, it's good. He's not dead. I still don't know where this other plane is. Okay, he's on fire, so we're going to leave him. It's a nice assist. Oh no, I got the kill for it. Maybe I set him on fire. Where's the other plane? Oh, the M19. I might try a little lander on this guy, maybe? Oh, he hit my tail off. Those shots looked nowhere near to it, but he done it. Right, let's get another one up. Let's go, David. David 2. 
Okay, my teammate dealt with a plane. I cannot see this guy on B. We've just lost because of that. Guys, ah, between the two buildings. We don't have the Did he just get exploded? Yeah, but too late. I see the other Sherman. I'm getting shot at by a BTR who's probably going to clip me. Please, bombs, do your thing. Nice. Right, where BTR? Guy's 50 cal on me too. An M16 just, an M13, sorry, just spawned in. And that Chaffee's down there too. Where's this BTR at? It's over. It's all ogre now. I missed every shot. But it's, it's game over anyway. The last amount of tickets are about to bleed out. Yeah, GG. Try my best. So, another lazy copy-paste vehicle for the battle pass as usual. I don't know if the thing is even worth it anymore. The Centurion looks good because it's at too low of a BR. I think it's 6.3, which is pretty insane. But here we are. David. I like the battle pass when the vehicles were actually good and you got four of them as well. Now that's kind of limited to three. With inflation now it's pretty expensive so they're really just not worth it at all unless you're selling the coupons to recoup your money back. But then again people have to buy them at inflated rates so really that doesn't help very much. Anyway that's me done for today. We're gonna do Dardo tomorrow since it's been requested quite a lot. I got two two A's or whatever. Uh, that sounds pretty good so let's get that done. A huge thank you to everyone who supports the channel by the way. I really appreciate you guys. To everyone over on Discord, it's tier 3, that's Miss Lita, Shadow Wolf, Toast McGee, D Bacchus, Sexy White Wolf, Audible Bow, Bofe Destare, Fearless Frighting, French Fish, Fearless Germ, Mushy Boy, Pac Ma Puma, Rusty, Stoyan, Train Toilet and Zig. And to everyone over on Patreon, that's Sickness Win, Matthew S, Paul Wendrigs, The Dago Guy, FTN, Watermelon, Shane McGuire, Achenius, and Stone One, Brandon aka The Flying Pickle, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Handsome Tatia, King of Salt Lord, Love of a Weasel, thank you very much, that's a really cool name, Ralph, Rage, Tectonic, Thanks for World, The Anomaly, Vanny and Warpig, Chef, Mortar and Stoy and Jtormy, David Pyrophoric and they won the only Rosalini. And to everyone else still here, thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye bye.